glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. For years, the Big Ten and the Pac-12 wanted to keep this jewel all to themselves. And who could blame them? Not me. An absolutely perfect setting for college football, the granddaddy of them all, as they say. And both teams have taken the field, ready to buckle up the helmets and do battle in the Rose Bowl. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming up next with Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I will see you at halftime. two teams won't have any love for each other in this gridiron bowl matchup. And now let's head down to the coin toss. It is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Syracuse is lined up to kick the ball off first and we are ready to go. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Fires quick to an open man, he dropped it. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 25. Check 59. Mike. Mike is 59. He scrambled. Tackle made at the 35-yard line. Well, this is a nice run for the first down by this quarterback. Michigan's got a guy that statistically is leading the conference right now, and he has got the attention of everybody in the country, including the coordinators. From midfield, it's first down. Caught with room to work. That's a great tackle at the 30. That's pretty impressive. Accuracy is important, but just as important as having receivers that can make plays. First and 10. Ball on the 30. scrambling and they got him and for Tyson he's having a good year five sacks on the season now he really fought to get to the quarterback that time he's certainly shown that he can get it done on a week-to-week -week basis delivers to the halfback on the screen Brought down at the 25. Thomas makes the tackle at the 25-yard line. That'll make it 35. Man left, man left. From the 25-yard line, third down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Screen, Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. Tackle at the 17. And this play is number eight on the drive. Around the 15-yard line. That makes it second and eight. 
It's second down and eight. Ball on the 15. He's tackled around the 12 yard line. This is the 10th play of this drive. Looks to the end zone. Quick throw in the end zone. Touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. And it takes some real accuracy on those deep quarter routes. So kudos to the quarterback. And he tacks on the extra point. A nice 10-play, 75-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. From their own 21-yard line, it's second down. Three down, three down. Where's 52? Left 52. Hey. He's out to the 30. They'll bring him down around the 36-yard line. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. It makes an offense so much more versatile. Three-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. And down he goes at about the 45. stop at the 42 they go with the option and pick up the first down yeah and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself that's a good decision first and ten ball on the 42 on the ground with the tailback and he's taken down around the 39 yard line scrambling he's at the 30 and they push him out at the 23 from the 23 yard line first down so an empty backfield with five wide receivers Gains his way to the 13-yard line. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. It's the ninth play of the drive. He gets out to about the 12-yard line. From the 12 yard line, it's second down. Go, 
He's on the run. He's taken down at about the nine yard line. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. They go to the ground and he stops short. Well, the question now is how will they respond after losing a couple on that run? Fourth down. This one should be makeable. The kick is up, and it is good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. Smith is lined up to kick this one off. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, they got the result you always want on the last drive. Let's see if it happens again. If you can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. From their own 23-yard line, second down, Michigan holds a four-point lead. Gets out to around the 32. That's a deal on that number one. That makes us third and three. Check, tight right, tight right, tight right. Go up there, check it out, up there. Three down, three down. Hey, I got number 80, I got number 80. We played one. The Wolverines lead 7-3. And we welcome you back to the action here, and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. Check 59, Mike. Mike is 59. Mike is 57. And he's level at the 25-yard line. Williams is back to receive. And he can't hang on to the ball. And he has it on the corner. Brought down at the 46. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. He's going to try and scramble. Runs with it, and he's got room. Tackle made at the 46-yard line. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Three down, three down. Hey, Mike 52. Mike 52. You like it. Ah. On play action. Pass out to the tight end, but it's incomplete. to about the 44-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 44. He's at the 30, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 27. It and he's hit hard immediately. 
the second and seven. seven. It's second and seven. Ball on the 24. Him hard at the 23 yard line. That's a good one on the play. Third down. Hey, hey, Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Slings it. Brought down around the 14 yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. They'll spread the field with five wide. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Now this is the kind of play you want to see if you're a defensive player because not only is it a negative play, but this can really impact and affect the emotion of the game. Just looking down and looking at the energy on the field and even on the sideline, you can see that the defense is fired up after that play. Takes the ball inside. He makes it to the 15-yard line. And this is the tenth play of the drive. Try to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback, and he tackles him hard at the 12-yard line. A three-yard gain on the old screen pass. It's a nice play by the defense to shut down all the lanes, so this halfback wasn't able to make anything happen on that play. It's up, and he got it. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding him to a field goal right there. Syracuse to kick. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Michigan is up one. They hand it off. Nice run there. Nelson gets six yards on the carry. They're about four yards away here on second down. Takes it right, he can't get back to the line. Now he tries to buy some time. Tackle at the 31 yard line. It looks like they're going to go after this punt. He dropped it. And down he goes at the 33. He was definitely peeking to see what kind of space he had to run. And that loss of focus is what cost him. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Setting up blockers or running backs, got it on the screen. Knocked out of bounds around the 43-yard line. Really a nicely thrown ball and a good job by the receiver to run right under it. From their own 43-yard line, first down. The offense going to try to open this field up coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Completes it across the middle. And that is a great call and a big game, especially on an early down. Just gets rid of it. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. 
Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Passes to the back, incomplete. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. They'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt. Syracuse is trying to take the lead here. He gets it up, and he missed it left. No good. Momentum swings have been fairly even, and with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Michigan with a one-point lead. He fires left side, makes the grab, and steps out right away. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll get a second look at it here and determine if he was inbounds when he hauled it in. And that play happened so fast that it was very tough to tell if he was able to get a foot down or not. After review the play, the ruling on the field stands. After review, they decided that the call on the field will stand. Man left, man left. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 41 yard line. Under pressure. Fumble, loose ball. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. And he might take this. And he will score. Splits the uprights with the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Wolverines know, I think, that at some point they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. And when a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. So it's second and 10. Ball in the 25. Quick throw, steps out of bounds, right around the 26-yard line. Let's see if this coaching staff sticks with the short passing game, or if they decide to open it up a bit more. He's going to air it long. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. Tate awaits the snap. Williams fields it to the 37. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Syracuse with a six-point lead. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. He's knocked out of bounds. Right around the 46-yard line. That makes it 
From their own 46-yard line, it's second down. I guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle. Going long. Leaps picked off. Well, we're headed to halftime now, and we're seeing two defenses that don't want to give an inch. Syracuse's lead is six. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. We've been looking forward to this game all week, and it has lived up to billing a close game you feel like that it's going to be a great second half and boy we've got the perfect guys in the booth what a reward today for nestler and herb street to get this game but you know it's not a secret reese they get the best game every week that we think's on the schedule right so they got this grave it's great it's close it's going back and forth i mean what a treat to watch one of the best games of the year just unfolding in front of us and more importantly to hear the silky smooth sounds of kirk herb street and brad nestler does it get any better? That's going to do it at halftime. Just about ready to start the second half. All right, you finish it up, brother. I'm going to get some of the cafeteria. I'm hungry. Wait, 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 don't leave until you get my order. Brad, Kirk, take the second half. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. And he got all of this one. Great kick. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Syracuse is up by six. He's tackled at the 28-yard line, and he's just taken over as the team's record holder for catches in a season. Sure, he's had some drops along the way, but he never hangs his head, never gets down on anyone for a bad pass or missed block. You need that kind of attitude to break records. And they push him out at the 31. They're about four yards away here on third down. Kirk, we saw this guy head to the locker room a little bit earlier. Good to see him back on the sideline, and it looks like he could be returning to the game. Over the middle to his tailback. And he's taken down around the 37-yard line. We'll pick up a first down on the play with a six-yard completion. This quarterback still hasn't missed a receiver on this drive. He laterals the ball. He might have a chance. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. the 40-yard line. First down. And down he goes at the 32. That makes it second and two. Taken down around the 35-yard line. So we're looking at another third down here. Syracuse up six. Scrambling around. He lost the ball. He picks it up. just shows you how determined this defense is. Great play by the linebacker to come up with the ball after the fumble. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. 
But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. They go to the left for a nice game. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. the stop around the 48 yard line get to that quick and it's going the other way he came up with a fantastic interception there well you know the quarterback is kicking himself for that one he just made the wrong read From their own 47 yard line. It's first down. Just throws this one away. Syracuse with a six point lead. Tackle made the 37 yard line. the 37-yard line. First down. Nice run up the middle. second the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass if you can get in there and disrupt the pocket then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers third down and they need to get it to the 27 here's the halfback on the screen they'll bring him down around the 29 yard line Kicks up, and it's wide left. No good. Every time you have a chance to finish a drive with points, you've got to capitalize. That time, they couldn't come through. They threw a pick the last time out. Should be interesting to see what they do this time. So much in football is about how you respond to adversity. Moving forward after a turnover is a perfect example of that. Tackled after decent pickup. That's a deep six on the ground. Second, Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Strike to his receiver, no good. Here's a case of a quarterback so eager to make the play that he failed to see the danger of that attempt and nearly gave the ball away. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. And watch out. They're going to bring the heat right here. Williams fields it at the 24. They'll bring him down at the 33-yard line. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Syracuse is up by six. Quick pass brought down around the 47-yard line.
first down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 47-yard line. Screen pass. He's got his halfback. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. That'll be a loss of one. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. From the 48-yard line, second down. To that quickly. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. He's on the run. Now he's going to run and watch out. And he's tackled at about the 27 yard line. They come out on an empty backfield. Fires incomplete. He was looking for the tight end. From the 27 yard line, it's second down. Syracuse up six. He goes out of bounds at the 24. From the 13 yard line, first down. Tackle at the one. The reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing. They have no idea whether you're passing or running, even if you need medium to long range yards. The quarterback trying to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. This is the 10th play of this drive. He's tackled around the two-yard line. We head to the final quarter, and we've got a great game on our hands. Syracuse lead is six. Well, this final few minutes is going to determine this one. Tight ball game. Action set to start here in the fourth quarter. Touchdown, Orange. Offense certainly did their job. They've extended their lead here in the fourth quarter, and now they look at their defensive counterparts and say, hey, guys, it's your turn. They'll go for two in this situation. And they won't get the two. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Smith has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Michigan's been doing special things on offense all season long, and not today. That's not what we've been expecting. This has been a shocker. These guys have had their way with almost every defense all year long. You come in expecting the same thing, and they lay an edge. I didn't expect to see this at all. 
gets out to about the 28-yard line. It's second and seven. Ball on the 28. He's hit and taken down. Throws it in a hurry. He makes his way to about the 48. He got the first down and much more. I'll tell you what, this guy is a threat every single time he touches the ball. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 48-yard line. Complete. He's got room. And he's taken down around the 36-yard line. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That makes it second and six. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. Breaks one. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. down and they've got their eyes on that goal line. They'll work the left side. Sheds one tackler and they get him in the backfield for a loss. And this is the eighth play of the drive. two-yard line. This is where the defense makes a name for themselves. It's third down and goal from the one. Touchdown, Wolverine. Yep, he punched that in from a short distance. He had great blocking up front on that play. And he converts the extra point. Andrews gets set to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 20. Williams has got the first of what should be many tackles to come. He's a heck of a player, really explosive and quick, a sure tackler, as you can see on that one. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. They'll spread the field with five wide. Here's the give. Runs it right. Nice pickup. That makes it second and six. From their own 24-yard line. Second down. The handback picks up a yard.
Setting up blockers or running backs. Got it on the screen, and he hits him hard at the 32-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. it out to about the 34-yard line. Michigan will take their first time out of the half. Thornton gains around two yards there on the misdirection run. Good pressure from the defense. They brought the heat. There wasn't much room for the running back to work with. Out of bounds at the 41-yard line. Slings it. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. They'll line it up again on third down. He's taken down at the 42, and he gets a yard on the run. Now it's fourth down, and these guys are going to have to punt this one away. So this game is really hanging in the balance right now. Phillips is the deep man awaiting the return. He really got a hold of that one. He dropped it. He was definitely peeking to see what kind of space he had to run. And that loss of focus is what cost him. Their last drive ended with a touchdown. Let's see what happens on this possession. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm. And a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against his team. Up the middle for a nice game. Good for a game of six yards. That brings him second and five. Switch, switch, switch. And he stops the clock with a spike. Third and five situation. Ball on their own 17. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Let's it fly. They knock it down, incomplete. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. And they make the stop around the 23-yard line. Dumps it complete over the middle. Tackle made at about the 25-yard line. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Third and long in the fourth quarter. If the defense gets a stop here, it might be a W. Bring him down around the 18-yard line. point here so they'll go for two and try to go up by three they come out in a five wide set he's under pressure they don't get it i think that one's on the offensive line they've got to do a better job of holding their blocks 
or else his quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Right, this has been a great game to watch. A lot of competitive spirit out there. The offenses seem to be going up and down the field. Back and forth we go. I think the winner will be which defense can make that pivotal stop to secure a victory. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Trying to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback, and he is drilled at the 27-yard line. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five-wide set. out of bounds at the 30-yard line. From their own 30-yard line. Third down. Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ballgame, and now the offense has got a chance to win it. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Now he tries to buy some time. So a big, big stop on fourth down here late in the fourth quarter. Defense stiffens there and gives it back to their offense. Well, the defense was waiting on that one. They've seen plays like that all season long. And they came up with a great stop. So not a lot of time left. And they've got an opportunity right now, if they score, to put the nail in the coffin in this game. Michigan with a one-point lead. He'll go down to one knee. Syracuse will have one timeout remaining. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. The offense lining up in a victory formation, and he takes a knee. Syracuse out of timeouts. Quarterback takes a knee, and that's always a good sign if you're a fan of this team. A great one to win, a really tough one to lose. 2019, Michigan. As we take a look at the highlights, Kirk, how would you summarize the action of this one? I'm sad to see this one in because it was a great game to watch. Syracuse played a good game out there, but they needed to make one or two more big plays, and they couldn't do it. Who knows? Another couple of minutes, and this one may have gone the other way. And for winning today's player of the game, EA Sports will make a $10,000 donation in his name to the school's general scholarship fund. For Michigan, their record will climb to 13 and 2 in what has been an outstanding season. And for the Orange, this loss will put a damper on what's been a great year.